Hi everyone! So the new update for Color or Die game on Roblox is out now and I played it yesterday. I beat it a couple times just to see what actually is changed and what is at the end and there is a chapter 2 there as well. Um, it is a bit harder than the first one but for now I will show you guys how to beat the new update for the first chapter. So we spawned in our regular room here. It is a little bit different. Let's close up this here. So we have this strange machine over here. Um, it's game to unlock on that wall, the white door. We have a chest. You can claim uh, lives if you like the game and join. Um, so let's um, see here. Shop, so the running shoes are in there and extra lives. There is pets. I have not seen any pets yet. Maybe they have not been added just yet. So let's go in and grab our first paint, which is red. I'm going to the right. I will show you the first hidden entrance through the wall. So it's right over here. We go up the ladder and here we will use our wooden plank when we get it. Alright, so oh, there is a bad guy coming already. Let's hide for a second. Alright, is it safe to go? Not yet. Alright, wait for a couple seconds. So I will collect a couple paint brushes first. I'm just gonna wait for this guy to walk away. So one is right over here. We'll pick it up. This is our first paintbrush. We still need to collect the 13 of them. We're gonna go out and go to the right. Alright, we'll keep going. Kinda go straight and right over here to the right again there will be another paintbrush. And right over here there's another hidden entrance. So we will need the hand saw to open that first. So we'll go out of here. Let's turn over here again to the right so there is another paintbrush right around the corner pick it up let's go find our red door the monster is right over here let's sneak by open the red door inside it you will find the screwdriver and there is the pink paint in there behind the glass that we'll have to smash with the hammer so first of all we will use the screwdriver in the hidden room it is located near the green room. So we'll go through this passage, pick up the paintbrush, and there is another hidden section right over here. You need the hammer to open this one, so let's go out, let's go over here, go past the orange door, over here, keep it to the right, and here, and the green door is right around the corner. So we're gonna pass that, and in the wall right in this area, you can squeeze through and open the area and it says what is this strange room so we look around and i almost left the room without the screwdriver so you have to pick up the screwdriver once again it is located right over here in this room so here is my screwdriver but it will be still useful so let's go out i'm gonna go back towards the green door past this area and we have to go back to the red area door so there's a little passage here we're gonna pass the red door that we already opened we will turn left and left and there is the area for the screwdriver open this go through the door so there is the obby it does look different compared to what it was in the first version of the game um, it is still fun. Um, you can fall through. You will just restart the obby again. So here we are. Let's pick up our new paint and the paintbrush. So now we have the orange paint. There is our teal door over here. We'll have to come back there later. So we'll have our orange paint. Let's go find the orange door. So we'll go back through here past the red door. I like taking this passage because you can hide from the monster in here if you have to. Alright, we're gonna go out, go left and left, and it's right here is our orange door. Inside it you will find the yellow paint. We will pick it up, and I like going to the right. And, okay. 
Let's hold on for a second. I really don't want to get caught just yet. Okay, let's see. Go over here and to the left. And hide. Okay, we'll wait for him to go by. So the yellow door is kind of straight ahead from me right now. So right over on this side of the blue pillar. So we're going to open this up. We need a hand saw for this area. And this door is already open. We're going to get in. And there is a brand new obby. At first it seemed quite complicated, but really it it's not. Um, all you have to do is just try to keep going up. Again, if you fall down, it's alright. You just restart from the bottom of this obby. Here we go. Let's go here and take a jump. And another jump. Just keep going up. Here we go. Occasionally I adjust my screen so I can see from up above. It's easier to see where my path goes so I don't fall down. We will keep going. Jump down here and up. And this little planks over here. Go up and one more. Here we go. So I can see the locked door straight ahead. I will pick up the green paint and the paintbrush. We will come out here. So we're in the yellow door right now. Okay, so we need to get to the green door. So I will go out to the right and kind of go straight. I will pass the red door, go through my little passage here, and go to the left and to the left again, and out to the right and to the right, and keep to the right for a little bit. Here we go. Enter the passage. So there is my green door. I will open that up. We need a triangle for this area, and I will pick up the paintbrush and the teal paint. So the teal door is still located in the door with that we opened with the screwdriver. So let's go back the way we came. Here we go. All right. This is our red door that we opened. We're going to pass that. Go here, left, and there is the screwdriver door. Go inside. we we'll go through the door again. You have to pass the same obby one more time. Here we go. Take your time. It's a little tricky sometimes. There we go. And again. And here. Perfect. Let's open the teal door now. And inside we will find the triangle and the paintbrush. So there is a hidden area to use the triangle in first. It is located near the purple door. So I will come out of this area with the screwdriver and head to the left. Kind of keep going straight for a little while. And here we go. So there is a purple door. I will pick up the paintbrush. And the hidden area is right over here. I will go inside. Place the triangle with a peculiar classroom. I will go in. Let's look around. So let's look at the classroom. Looks like somebody drew on the wall. Don't forget to pick up your other triangle. Take that. Let's come out of this hidden area. So now we have to go back to the green room. We are going towards the red room at the moment. We will pass it right now. So that was a red room. Let's go through my passage here. And here turn left and right and right and left. And here we go through the little passage. There is our green door. Put the triangle inside. You will find the blue paint. So we can go out of the green door and kind of go straight a little and then keep to the right. Keep going straight. We passed our pink door. We're going to pass the paintbrush door. Just going to keep going straight and there is our blue door there but first I want to check in behind here with the staircase there is a paintbrush here so we have to pick that up as well so I noticed there is some sort of a map on the wall I'm not exactly sure if 
we will need it at some point of the game. Um, I looked at it for a while, but I wasn't sure what it's for. So let's jump down, open our blue door, and inside there will be the handsaw. So we will pick that up, and we will go back to the secret area where we need to use the handsaw first. It is near the safe zone, kind of to the left of it, if um, you're looking straight from the safe zone. So we're going to go back over here and go through this little passage, past our purple door. We will keep going here and here. So we are going towards the safe zone right now, but not quite. We're going to turn over here and right inside between these two walls. All right, let's cut that. Whose room is this? So let's see, there's a ladder going up. Climb up, don't forget to pick up your other handsaw. Be careful not to lose the one. And let's look around the room. It just looks like a room with some cabinets, some paintings. Not much in here, really. Okay, let's go back. So we do need to use our saw inside the yellow room. So let's go out here. We will go to the right and to the right again. All right, and whoops, I think that's the wrong way. Okay, over here. And here we go, and the yellow room is right over here. Okay, let's cut this and pick up the plank. You go through the door, there is another obby. You can complete this one. Again, don't worry if you fall, you just restart the obby again. Take your time, go slow if you need to. There we go, a couple more jumps and we have another paintbrush and the purple paint. So first we want to go use the plank in the secret area in the wall. It is located near the safe zone. When we just started, I showed you guys. So let's go here and over here. Go past the screwdriver door and this little hidden area. So let's go. So it's right over here in the wall. Let's go inside. We go up the ladder and place the plank right over here. Why is there a living room up here? So we can go see. Don't forget to pick up your other plank. Perfect. There is a living room here. It looks like some chairs and couches. Alright, let's go down. So we are near the safe zone, so now we have to go towards the purple door. So we will just cross through the safe zone, take a shortcut, and we'll go here, keep going straight, we'll turn left over here, and a bit to the right, and there is our pur purple door, let's open that, there is a ladder going up. We will take that. All right. Do not forget the paintbrush over in this area. Let's pick that up. Come out and place our plank over here. Let's cross over, and there you will find the hammer. So first, we need to use the hammer in the hidden area. It was not too far from the red door. So let's hold on for a second. Alright, I'm just going to go down um, the way I came up, so I will take this ladder down, that way I know where I am. Let's look around. Alright, I'm going to go to the right and keep going for a little bit, kind of keep to the left. I'm going to see. Alright, there is the red door, I just passed it, there is a hidden area. So the hidden area I need to 
get into is right across this hallway. So let's wait for the monster to pass. Alright, I think it's good to go. Let's go. So you go straight through the wall here. Break the glass. It says a bedroom. Best not stay too long. Don't forget to pick up your other hammer. Let's look around. It looks like just like a bedroom. There's some books. I'm not sure why some are purple, but that's okay. Let's come out. Let's get back over here. We need to go back into the red room now and smash the glass in there. Let's do that. Let's pick up our pink paint. We will go out and go to the right. Let's see. Let's keep going and right again. I would like to go straight, but the monster is right there, so I want to wait for a second. Make sure he goes away. We are doing pretty good. We're pretty close to the end now. I have the 12 paint brushes out of the 13. Here we go, past the pink wall and the pink door is right over here. Let's open that up and the key is inside it. So the door for this key is located inside the yellow door. Let's go back over here and our yellow door is right here. The door is open, let's go in. We have to go up this little obby again. Let's go up and up. So we only need one more paintbrush and then the door will open. That um, keeps the white paint inside it that we need to complete the game. Let's keep going up. So just make sure when you collect your screwdriver your triangle, your handsaw and hammer. There are the secret doors. There is really nothing inside them to collect, but they're quite nice to check out. Let's go up here. All right, we made it to the top. So we can open this door over here now with the key. And you can see there is our last paintbrush in there. So it says you have them all, something should have opened. So let's come out of the store. So we are in the yellow door right now. We need to get to the back here. So we'll take left and left again a little bit. All right, past the yellow wall, kind of to the back of the map. And the door opened, the one that you need, the 13 paintbrushes. You go inside, you have to go to the back of the room and you will find your white paint that you have to pick up. Let's go and grab that. Pick that up. And again, it's up to reach the end. You must seek the beginning. It's the same as in the first version of this game. So let's go out of this room. The beginning is at the area where your safe zone is, so we'll go right, get to the right a little bit, and then turn left. We'll pass our blue door. We'll go through the little passage over here, past the purple door. There we go. Keep going. Keep to the right a little bit, and just keep going straight. And the safe zone should be right over here. So let's go ahead and open our white door. You have escaped, or did you? What are these four doors? So I went ahead and I picked the first door first. You get inside and you see the countdown. So let's see what's gonna happen here. Alright, so I was not exactly sure where I am. I couldn't see where to go. 
and it said that I could not escape. So I went back and I completed the game again. So I got my white paint and this time I decided to choose the door number 3. Let's go in. Again you have your 10 second countdown. got the win. I went back to the lobby. So I got my badge for completing the new version of the stage one. And then I could see the door opened over here. It says chapter two at the end of the hallway here. So you go inside and there's a really nice room. Looks like a waiting room. Maybe if you just want to sit down and hang out while some of your friends finish the first chapter there is the elevator once you go inside the 30 second countdown will start and in 30 seconds you will be transported into the chapter 2 um, I quite enjoyed the update actually I love those hidden rooms in the walls um, that makes the game a little bit longer but it's still very nice Obbies are nice as well. Let's see, so the doors closed and it takes us to color dye chapter two. So the beginning looks kind of like chapter one as well. Let's close this up. Alright. You also need the white paint to get the wind. Anyways, I went ahead, I completed the chapter one once more. I just wanted to see what's behind the door number two. I skipped the door earlier, but I really want to see what's in it. So again, we have our 10 second countdown. Let's see where we're gonna end up. All right, so it looks like this is the exit as well. So. I kept running, there is a little bad guy. You just keep running down the hallway. Here we go. And through the exit door. So for me, the door number one and three did not work, but the door number two and four gave me the win and opened the chapter two. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You can see I have 10 wins altogether and 2 wins in the new update. Um, log in and check out this game. It's quite fun. I hope this video will help you beat it so you can follow the steps. And I will definitely work on chapter 2 and will try to create a video and show you where everything is in this chapter. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!